next race on the track is event 286, the girls under 12, 800 metre final. In lane one, we have Chelsea from Caulfield. Lane two, Charlotte from Frankston. Lane three, Declan from Mornington. Lane four, Scarlett from Kahuna. Lane five, Adriana from Caulfield. Lane six, Sienna from Knox. Lane seven, Charlotte from Caulfield. And in lane eight, Sharni from Portland. The VVP in this event is 59.33, set in 2017 by Josie from Casey. So again, that is the final competitors in the girls, under 12, 4 to 100 metre final. I think with this headwind, the Victorian best performance is safe today. It's going to need a big tailwind in order for these times to fall. 59.33. That's Josie Lawton. Josie Lawton will be competing in a couple of age groups' time in this, actually. The under 14, so... Or under 15, under 14, 15, something like that. So we'll see her potentially come out and win the gold. But right now we're focused on the under 12 girls 400 metre final. I'm sure these girls are very nervous coming into this race. And as we saw in the heats, I'm going to pick it. I think Declan Tanner is going to be the one to win this. And then Adriana Scandalis from... Caulfield and pos pos uh, possibly Sienna Kurtigan from Knox as well. Oh, and, and Charlotte Nelson. So great start here by these competitors. There's no false start in this race. It's all even running right now with Declan Tanner challenging the rest of her competitors. The, the, the competitors that are in front of her don't know she's coming, but she's got some fantastic momentum as she go down, goes down the back straight. So Declan Tanner challenging every one of her competitors in this race. But it is going to be hard to catch. It does look like the Portland athlete there in Shani Hutchinson has gone out very strong. She's starting to waver right now. She's running as hard as she can because she's running blind in lane eight. She's got no idea who's running behind her. So it does look like the Scarlet Southern Kahuna is challenging Declan Tanner. But Declan is now coming to the front straight and looking very comfortable, might I add. She's not wavering at all. But it does look like the Knox athlete, Sienna Kurtigan, is going to come through, potentially pick up the silver. Nope. Kahuna athlete, Scarlett, is going to grab the silver with Declan Tanner in the gold. And then Knox athlete, Sienna Kurtigan, coming through for the bronze. They ought to be wrapped with that time and wrapped with that performance. That time is a 101.96 unofficial.